Hi, my name is Michael James, and my friends call me the Grape Meister. I've been growing grapes and making wine for a number of years, and in this video series, I'd like to share those experiences with you. In this video, I'm going to briefly cover the following material. I'm going to show you why you need to be alert for possible pests, the types of diseases you can see in your vineyard, what fungicides can do, as well as additional pests to grapevines and the common insect types. Planting vineyard crops requires specialized knowledge. A vineyard is a multitasking operation between knowing the type of soil, spacing the trellises, pruning regularly, all vineyard owners need to also know how to deal with pests. Insects and animals both love grapes as much as we do. The types of pests that affect your vineyard include animals, insects, and diseases. Birds and deer are the most common type of animals that love to eat berries. The diseases include cane mildew, fungus, black rot, and leaf spot. If your vineyard grapes are suffering from some kind of disease, you will see leaf lesions and discoloration. If you see a thin, film-like coating on the leaves of your plant, it's usually a fungus that will cause this. The first line of defense that you can employ to defeat these diseases is a fungicide. After spraying this remedy, you will usually see improvement within a few days or weeks. However, if this does not help improve the condition of your plant, then you might want to look deeper and study the particular type of disease that is affecting your grape. As mentioned earlier, deer and birds are the most common animals that raid vineyard grapes. One of the most effective ways to repel birds is the use of nets. Draping netting over your vines will discourage the birds. Be sure to remove those nets during the winter time because leaving the nets on trellises during the cold season might damage the plant's productivity and growth in the next season. If you're dealing with deer, however, nets might not help. What you can do to drive away deer or even birds is by using physical repellents or loud noises that scare them away. However, if your vineyard is just in your backyard, you might want to look for another way to drive away these animals because loud sounds could be quite annoying to your neighbors. Since coyotes are predators of deers, you might want to use the scent of coyotes as a repellent which is available online from several distributors. When you see holes on the berries of the leaves, your vines are probably suffering from insect infestation. Many insects like the vegetation of various plants, but grapevines are particularly susceptible to rose chafers, to grapeberry moss, and to Japanese beetles. Insecticides are the best way to deal with these pests, and the best way to find which ones to use is to call your local ag department. For a free 10-part mini-course on how to grow grapes and making your own wine, go to my website, www.totalwinesystem.com. Really, it's free. Why wait? Do it now. If you do, you're going to be well on your way to starting an exciting and satisfying pastime that I've enjoyed for all these years.